screen back. recording. Hey guys, this is Connor from the Place of Minecraft, and I'm back again with Cypher 17 to demonstrate to you and teach you the basics of redstone. Now, today we're going to be showing you the ore gate, which is perhaps the simplest kind. Okay. You have so, deal. first, what I'm going to do. I'm so, uh, shut, shut up, Connor. I'm, I'm cutting in, you know. Okay. Sorry. Um, so, I'm going to explain what the ore gate does. So, oh, what's Tim doing? Um, <laughs> He's <still laughs> on the piston. So, the ore gate. All right, let's let's watch Tim go up here. Um, if one input, which we've got um, powered by this lever here, is on, then the piston goes up. Or the other gate can, uh, the other pi there lever can be on, and the piston goes up. So it's just like one or the other, hence or or gate. both <gasps> or both. Oh, that's well crazy. Or you can have both. Um, so really all it is is just wires to connect and then go to a single output but um, so things like this can get a little complex uh, when you're using much larger circuits so notice when I turn one of these levers on the redstone current goes all the way around here it goes into the piston but then some of the current also goes back the way towards the other lever so in this case it doesn't actually have an effect but in some circuits where you've got like sensitive outputs back back coming um, somewhere else which then leads to this input so you've got something else more complex instead of this lever then um, this redstone feedback it's, it could well screw up your circuit so what you can do to fix that problem is you put a repeater just before the join. So we can put a repeater here and a repeater here. Now, as you can see on the repeater, there's like a little picture of an arrow. Almost. And that's basically the direction that the redstone actually travels. And it will not travel back through that. That's this that's why this works like that. Yeah, exactly. So if you know anything about real life circuits a repeater is like a diode. Mm -hmm. So I'll, I'll just demonstrate. So I flick the lever here. The redstone current goes along and it goes in the correct direction because you see the, the repeater has got the arrow pointing this way. So the current goes in the back of the arrow and comes out the front of the arrow, the pointy end. But here it won't go through the repeater because it's like it's hitting the wrong side of the arrow. The current only travels in the direction of the arrow. And so there's no feedback towards the other lever, and it's all good. Right, so guys, we better wrap this one up. We This is a very, very simple thing, and we've probably been talking way too long. So thanks for watching. Bye. Bye-bye.